Surgery should look effortless, from the way you hold your forceps to how you pass your suture through the wound edges. When tying your knot, you do not need to apply maximum strength, simply enough force to bring the wound edges together, dermis to dermis, epidermis to epidermis. You can learn some of our easy techniques to suture fast, whilst maintaining precision, in the bite-sized videos below. Hold your forceps so you have control, the needle holder mounted on the pads of your fingers, not at the base, and allow your wrist to rotate, following the curve of the needle in its entirety. When you tie a knot, keep the short end around two centimeters long and hold the long end reasonably close to the wound bed. Wrap the suture around the tips of the needle holder and retrieve the short suture by its tip. This prevents getting caught in knots. When you place your sutures across a wound, ensure they are evenly spaced at the same distance from the wound edges on both sides and the knots lay on one side of the wound itself. The simulator in this tutorial is by my suture. Let us know your thoughts and what you'd like to see next in the comments below.